Okay, good evening. My name is Agent Whisper, Soldier Third Class. It is my understanding that you are here to participate in the application for Soldier, is that correct? Then it is my pleasure to welcome you to the Shinra Corporation for your examination. So, let's begin. Uh, what is your name, please? All right, and how do you spell that, please? And your surname? Wonderful. And if I might ask how old you are, if it's not too much of an impertinent question, but it is relevant to our research. Thank you. And please tell me, what is your residence in Midgar? Oh, I see. It's quite a prevalent sector. Good for you. And what is your hometown? Were you born in Midgar or did you venture here from elsewhere? Ah, so that's it. Why am I not surprised? Okay, so as we progress we will be doing a full in-depth head-to-toe examination, uh, but just for our initial queries, uh, what is your height? Are you sure? Okay, if that's what you say it is, then the examination will verify. And your weight? This is not my first day conducting the soldier physical examination application. Thank you. And your shoe size? Thank you. As I said, the physical examination will confirm your details, but it does us good in advance to have a record of these facts so that we may acquire a uniform for you. If you are successful, we would like to rush you into active duty as soon as possible. I hope this is agreeable to you. Yes, of course, after your <clears throat> training is concluded. Nothing but the best in soldier. Okay, just hair colour, eye colour, thank you, that will do for my initial inquiries. Now, the Shinra Corporation and its relevant subsidiary companies are in no way liable for any unforeseen circumstances that are a result of any further examinations or tests. Is this agreeable to you? Fantastic. So if you could, uh, if you could just sign here. Uh, initial here and here. Uh, signature here. Thumbprint here. Uh, today's date. Uh, tick this box here. And a triple signature just here. Thank you. Yes. Thank you, that all seems to be very much in order. If you could please just excuse me for one moment. Okay. 
So to commence the soldier physical entrance examination, we are going to begin with an eye test. So I'm going to hold up fingers on either side and I would like you to tell me which finger I am moving, right or left. Very good. Now can you tell me how many fingers am I holding up? Three. Four. One. Three. Seven. Seven. Eight. Two, six, ten, seven. Good, good. You are now going to see a few images. I would like you to identify what you can see. Yes, this is a cactar. Very good. That is indeed a chocobo. Next image. That is a moogle. Next image. Ah, yes, this is a very popular area of Midgar. You have been there, I take it. Next image. It's perfectly acceptable if you do not know the name of this creature, but if you could just please describe it to me as best you can in your own words. Good. Thank you. That concludes the image exam. Now to test your notice skills, I'd like you to just close this eye for me and just follow my finger. Good. And open this eye and close your other eye. And follow my finger. This side. The other side. The middle. Good. Now I'd like you to keep both of your eyes open and just focus on my finger. That's it. Follow it to one side and the other side. Maintain your focus. Maintain your focus. Good. Very nice. Doesn't seem to be any noticeable issue there. Very well done. The second part of the soldier entrance examination physical test is an auditory exam. So first I'm going to be playing a few noises and I would like you to identify the sounds to the best of your ability. First sound. That's right. Second sound. Correct. Third sound. Very good. Fourth sound. Splendid. Last one. One more. Okay. 
So now I am going to be whispering certain key words in both of your ears, and I would like you to repeat the words I say. So, shit. Moogle. Please repeat the words back to me. Nice. Now this ear. Soldier. Midgar. Golden Saucer. Please repeat the words back to me. Good. A few more. Reunion. Sephiroth. Genova. Reunion. Sephiroth. Genova. Maybe you didn't hear me clearly enough. Sephiroth. Reunion. Genova. Sephiroth. Reunion. Genova. Interesting. No, just some random nonsense words that I just plucked from thin air. Just, you don't need to understand the meaning, but if you could just please repeat them to me. Mm. Good, there seems to be no issue with your hearing. Good, very good. On to the next part of the exam. I'm just going to be measuring your body. So first off, I'd like to measure your cranium. So if we just do across the forehead. Okay. And now the height of your head from forehead to chin. Okay, now I want to just measure slightly around your neck. Oh, it's a hypersensitive microphone. You're not supposed to hear this. This is for the ears of Hojo only. It's a very, very prominent scientist in his field. Where would Soldier be today if not for the magnanimous work of Professor Hojo? Okay, if you could just uh, hold out your arm for me, please. I'm going to measure your shoulder to your wrist. Okay, so shoulder to the wrist. Okay. 
I am also making notes on the musculature of your appearance. Uh, also examining for any areas that might need to be strengthened during training. We don't want to injure you early on, but we would like to uh, give you some muscle reinforcement where necessary. Uh, your other arm, if you just please hold your arm out like so for me. Thank you. If you could just uh, stand up as straight as you can for me, please. But, you know, that out, shoulders back, and just try. I'm going to now measure you from head to toe. Yeah, if you could, can you just hold that for me? Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Uh, yeah, so that's going to be. Uh, it's quite cool. Uh, yes, very good frame. Uh, decent posture. Okay, thank you very much. Now I'm going to do the same thing, but I'm going to do it from behind you. So if you could just please again stand up nice and tall, proud chest, uh, shoulders back, and just breathe and relax for me. Thank you. Okay, so if you could please remain standing, I'm now going to measure you from your waist down your outside leg. Okay, and so that is quite fine as well. There seem to be good steady legs, good frame. And now the other side, uh, yep, yep, it's right there. Okay, that's very Okay, so it is this side. This side? This side is like shoulder up. It's going to be interesting. Okay, thank you very much. And uh, I just need to do across your chest. Okay, and I'm just going to measure around your midriff. So. Okay, so around the midriff does need some work. But there could be adjusted with very minimal effort. And in a peak physical. Okay, thank you very much. That concludes the measurements. Uh, please wait right there for one moment. Okay, so for the next part of the physical examination, I'm going to be uh, laying my hands on you in certain areas just to examine uh, muscles. I'm going to start with your head, work my way down your body and I would like you to tell me what it is you feel when I apply pressure in certain points. Okay so I'm going to start with your head and your face so first 
off, I'm just going to massage your temples. So if you could just... Okay, I'm going to tap the side of your head. If you could just tell me which side I'm tapping. Left. Right. Left. Left. Right. 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 Both. Very good. And if I just apply slight pressure. Okay. So now I'm going to cover one actually if you could just first close your eyes okay if you can just try and open your eyes for me good okay now open your eyes as wide as you can okay i'm going to try close your eyes but don't let me close them want to fight me okay fight 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 good okay so I'm now going to place my hand on the side of your head and I would, I'm going to try and turn your head, but don't let me fight it, okay? And fight, 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 fight. Good. And now the other side, I'm going to apply pressure. Don't let me move your face. Go. Fight, 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 fight. fight. Excellent. So now I'm going to place my hand under your chin. I'm going to try and move your face up. Don't let me. Fight, fight. fight. Very good. And now, same thing, top of the head. I'm going to try and push your face down. Put pressure against me. Uh, good. Fight. fight it. Fight, 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 fight. Excellent. Very well done there. Okay. I'm just going to apply pressure to your cheekbones. Okay. I'm just going to examine the glands underneath between your neck and your chin. Okay, open your mouth so you say ah. Okay, close your mouth please, thank you. Okay, now uh, I want you to put your hand against mine and same thing, push, 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 push. Good. And the other one, uh, push, 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 push. Very good. Now, I would like you to uh, place your hands out front of you like this. I'm going to try and push your fingertips up, uh, but don't let me do it. Okay, and go. Fight, 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 fight. Excellent. So now I'm going to do the same thing, but downwards. And fight, 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 fight. Excellent. Now, I'm just going to examine your shoulder from the side. So... Okay, so what does it feel like if I press here? What does it feel like if I press here? And if I press here? Any pain? No? Good. Okay, I'm now going to place one hand underneath your armpit. And tell me, do you feel any unusual sensation there? Okay, that feels great. Okay, so please put your arm in my, my hands and just relax. I'm going to move your arm around. That's right, just the whole weight of your arm. Just let me move you. Great. Okay, now just uh, put your hand, just going to examine your hand. Just relax your hand. Okay, so it's the knuckles. Finger, okay, and the nails, right, okay. Uh, turn your palm face up, please. Okay, so palm. okay, very good. I'm now going to do the same thing, but on the other side. So starting from the shoulder, okay. How does it feel if I press here? All right, and if I press here, okay, and here, any pain? No? Okay, good. Now I'm going to put my hand underneath your armpit. Any unusual sensation there? Okay. And the ribs. All seem to be whole, no broken. Okay. Uh, I'm now going to work my way down your arm. Mm 
okay you do have very good muscles i will tell you that uh, but we can definitely improve upon them with training if your application is successful okay and just let yeah give me the weight of your arm let me bend your elbow down not good good now just relax same as before let me move your arm rotate it in the shoulder blade all around good and let me yeah just relax your elbow and your wrist just let your arm go floppy while i assess your motor movement skills okay good now again rest your hand in line okay wrist do some mobility joints thumb knuckles fingers nails okay palm face up okay same thing wrist okay thank you that is fine i'm now going to do a similar procedure i'm just going to go down and i'm going to do the same thing with your legs okay so i'm going to start off this side around your hips okay and how does that feel if i place pressure here okay and here good and how about here it all seems nominal okay and the other side same thing the other hip I'm going to apply pressure here and here good and here okay and what about your stomach what if i apply a slight pressure here okay good that's perfectly normal it seems okay now i'm going to have a look at this head this leg so i'm just going to examine the leg muscle okay and the knee have you ever had any knee injuries okay working my way down okay so so that's the top okay bottom half of the leg and back down okay and, okay good and the other side this leg starting from the top just examining the muscles pressure good and the knee yeah that one looks much better work my way down work my way down okay very good okay so you seem to have a strong sturdy set of legs so now could you please sit down for me okay and same thing as we did with the arms i'm going to test your legs one by one i would just like you to let them flop give me the weight of your leg and i'm going to test your mobility okay so the first joint of the hips any discomfort please let me know straight away okay knee okay good i'm now going to rotate your foot to examine the mobility of the heel and the ankle okay i'm now going to flex your toes okay that seems fine put that leg back down and now the other leg, seeing the rotation of the hip. Yep, yep, relax, give me your weight. Okay, the knee, extend, retract, extend, retract. Same thing, I'm going to rotate your foot to examine your heel and your ankle. Very 
good. I'm now going to flex your toes back. Okay, down. Okay, thank you very much. Very good. So now I'm going to place my hands on one knee and the same thing. I'd like you to push up, fight against my pressure. And don't let me push you down. Okay, so open up, fight, 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 fight. Good and down. And the other knee. Okay, fight, 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 fight. Okay, good. I'm now going to do the same thing with your toes. First, I would like you to stop me pushing them down and then stop me pushing them up. So, okay. And go. Fight, 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 fight. Good. And the other way. Yep. Push, 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 push. Okay. Thank you very much. You have very adequate muscles, but as I said, there's always room for improvement. Being a soldier is about being the best you that you can be after all, as so they will tell you in the training videos. Okay, please bear with me. We are now going to be testing your Marco resistance. Now, there's no easy way to say this, but we need to place you under the influence of certain Marco effects using Materia. It's a very useful tool. I assure you it is quite safe. These are going to be uh, relatively secondary effects. No fire, no lightning, no ice, no nothing like that. So. We're going to be testing your resistance to sleep, confuse, and there's another fun one which we'd like to play around with. Uh, but if I inform you as to what that material is, it might affect the results. So first, resist sleep. Sleep, 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 Very good, you seem to show very high resistance to sleep. Right. This is a different material. This one will confuse you. You may hear some unusual things from your subconscious mind and you may feel a little bit disorientated but that is entirely normal for this part of the test and it will pass instantaneously when I end the <clears throat> spell. I prefer to use the word effect. Magic is so unscientific. Okay. The fires lit the horizon behind the neighbors, made blacker than the night rolled toward them between the rows of the elephant, not the crackling roar growled gasping the time. She tried to urge Mist to run faster. Fishy, fishy, look as dishy. Need to rest, El. Congratulations, this is completely wrong. But the fire, we've got a good lead. The wind Don't here you start sharpening your pencils at me? Behind her and pulled on the rails. Mist slowed to a walk. Maybe we should have swum to Australia instead. The frogs are much nicer than the horse. Mist hugged. I forgot to do the shopping because I left my head in the Eyes wide and fright. Okay, so please can you tell me what you felt and experienced during being put under the effect of that materia. 
Really? Intriguing. Shall we continue? Good. Nothing was ever achieved by doing nothing. All right, so this is the last materia we shall be using to test your Marco resistance. Now you have not been informed as to the effects of this materia. Are you prepared to proceed? All right. Here we go. Huh. All right. Uh, try to remain calm. Uh, it appears that you have been transformed into a frog. Mm. Uh, don't be alarmed. Uh, similar things have happened before. Uh, I once had a candidate who transformed into a chicken. Uh, uh, and funny enough, uh, proceeded then to lay an egg. Uh, please don't do that. If you feel any laying or nesting urges, please try to refrain from such activities and stick to uh, human thoughts. Try to uh, mm, maintain your sense of humanity as best you can under the duress of the situation. Uh, so could you uh, please just uh, uh, make uh, some kind of noise or gesture to indicate that you understand my attempts at communication? Okay, good. Very good. Yeah. It's a good frog. It's a very good frog. Slimy. Uh, but good. So if you go... Uh, normally, this type of effect does wear off on its own. Uh, but we're just going to have a look at you. Uh, if you could please uh, make a mental note of any uh, audible differences, uh, any visual differences, uh, you, your whole metabolism has been completely uh, rearranged uh, down to a subatomic level. Uh, but this is science, uh, not magic, uh, science. Okay. Okay, now I would like you to make a mental, uh, physical and spiritual effort to shrug off the effect. So, just of all your might, just to think human thoughts. Think human thoughts. Uh, imagine that you are soldier. Think soldier. Good. Good. There, all back to normal. See? Nothing to worry about. You may feel slightly discombobulated for a while, uh, but that is perfectly normal after undergoing such an extreme physical transformation. Uh, even though this is the first time, I promise you it shall not be the last. Okay, please just breathe and relax while I remove the materia.
So the examination has uh, gone extremely well. I have ticked all the boxes, dotted the I's and crossed all the T's. So I've done my job. Uh, you will be receiving the results of your physical exam in phase two very soon. Before we conclude, just a few follow up questions. So, why have you decided to join Soldier? Okay. Uh, just for your information, uh, there will be a written theoretical part later on. That is one of the questions, but I will need a longer answer than that. But your short phrase there satisfies the requirements of this assessment. Uh, now, have you had any type of martial arts training or any relevant fighting experience? Anything that might be relevant or applicable to a combat situation? Okay, and what is your preferred choice of weaponry? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have a wide selection of armaments, uh, all crafted right here in Shinra HQ uh, by our research and development division. Okay. Okay, thank you very much for coming in and taking part in this initial soldier physical examination. As part of your application, you may be required to go through a second round along with some other applicants. We will let you know in due course. Please do not call us. A Shinra representative will call you and invite you back for further testing. So please keep checking your messages we will keep you posted uh, once again my name is whisper soldier third class uh, it has been my pleasure to indoctrinate you in the soldier physical examination application and i hope to welcome you back to shinra headquarters soon uh, this global corporation uh, has the best interests of all its citizens at heart. Thank you very much. Uh, you can show yourself out. Goodbye. Hey guys. Hola. Bonjour. Konnichiwa. It has been a very long time since I have had the opportunity to create ASMR. Uh, so this is a little post, pre, post? Yeah, this is post. This is a post, uh, a post video. Hello, uh, just to say it's good to be back and I hope to be doing more videos. Um, I would like to thank you for sticking with me and with this channel and for all of the lovely, lovely motivational and supportive messages you guys have been sending over the years. This is my first video in a long time, so if you are still awake, I would really appreciate your feedback and your patience. I am getting back into it. I am dusting off uh, all my old skills, learning some new ones. I have some new equipment and I'm going to be playing around with a lot of ideas. So peace and positivity to all of you. Thank you for watching.